Hello, I'm a, my name is Anthony, and I'm a sophomore from Lincoln Southeast High School. Nice. And this poem is called Mixed Feelings. <laughs> I hate you. You treat me so horribly and belittle me every chance you get. Due to that, I've stopped talking to you. It's for the best. Obviously, look at how happy you are without me. You replace me so quickly, and as much as I hate you for doing, doing it so quickly, I wish we could have worked out. I can't explain it, but I still love you. You left me with so many memories and that now I have nothing to do with, like that time on our three month anniversary when we made brownies just to eat them straight out of the pan after dipping our forks in frosting. I remember how much you hate, how mu I remember how you knew how much I hated dates. So for a good amount of the time we stayed in and even when we did go out, you made it worthwhile. I remember all the art galleries we used to go to, which usually resulted in me just, mes just admiring your beauty with a different background that I was accustomed to. I'm not going to talk about getting lost in your mesmerizing eyes because our relationship was the opposite of cliche. I check your Instagram whenever I miss you and it makes me so happy to see you smile. You found the love that I was hoping to find, and at this point I can't tell if I miss you or if I miss the feeling that you gave me. So for as long as I can, rem as long as I can remember, I've had this wall around my heart, and you walked through as if it was nothing. Donald Trump would be mad. <laughs> <laughs> I hate myself for dumping you, and if I had to write a book about my life, it would start on the day November 5th, 2015 the day we started going out. You turned me into the best version of myself and you're the reason I'm standing here today. You showed me the, my first poem and gave me the confidence I needed to be myself. Every time I think about you, it mo motivates me to do better and the more I think about it, maybe you were never trying to belittle me, you were just trying to give me constructive criticism. Either way, you've changed me. I miss you so much. Last night I visited your house on Google Maps just to see the street view. <laughs> I knocked on your door three times before realizing I was just sitting behind a glass screen all alone in my room. I want to call you so badly, but I feel like I'm chained down, and the more I reach for you, the more I realize that I'm the only one holding myself back. No matter how much I want to tell you that I miss you, I never do, because I already know how that would work out. I'm not ready for someone as good as you to be in my life. I'd push you away again, and I'm just not ready to, for that. I've tried to move on so badly, but oddly enough, being in a relationship makes me think about you that much more. And maybe I haven't let you go yet because my heart can't be broken if there's nothing left to break. <laughs>